Even if you're only a very, very occasional player of Battlefield games, or you just watch them passively from the sidelines whilst you play others, I think you've probably still heard of the amount of easter eggs that DICE manages to cram into their titles. Going back to Battlefield 4, we had the infamous Megalodon easter egg and the Phantom program, and in Battlefield 1, we've had the Masterman easter egg and, of course, some other ones as well. Today, a step forward was made with an easter egg that's been laying dormant for about a year or so on the Fort DeVoe map. A few of you might remember the Is Solomon door on Fort DeVoe near the E flag on Conquest. Now behind that door, you used to be able to hear a ghostly wail of some sort, but there was no obvious way to get on the other side of it. That has changed with the latest patch. With Battlefield 1 being updated, there is now a way to get behind that door and explore the room on the other side. The process of opening the door is quite straightforward, but it requires a bit of running around the Fort DeVoe map. There are several signs located on different walls of the fort that now hide a secret, a button system. The buttons poke through each of the signs on a specific letter. These letters spell out E. Solomon and need to be pushed in the correct order to spell the word. The folks over at the Battlefield Easter Egg Discord have made a handy map here that shows you all of the locations of the buttons that make it a little bit easier for you to complete this Easter Egg, and have even spent the time to work out which order you need to push the buttons for the two different E's in the word E. Solomon. So good work from you guys and girls. I've left a link to the Battlefield Easter Egg Discord down in the description if you want to go and join the crew there. Once you've been on your marathon sprint around Fort DeVoe, you'll come back to push the last sign button near the Is Solomon room door, and once you've hit that button, which denotes the T from Is Solomon, then you'll need to turn around and hit this button on the opposite wall, and that will trigger the door to open, and then you can step inside. If the door doesn't open, then you'll need to go through the process again of hitting all the buttons in the right order. When you enter the room, you will notice there is no wailing monster zombie vampire thing in there, which is a shame, but instead you're presented with a cell that's been deserted. Inside the now unlocked room, there are a few things, however, that might come into play for the next stage of this easter egg. First of all, in the corner, there's some sort of tunnel that goes right down below the map. At this time, it's not 100% clear what the function of this actually is, but you can throw a grenade down there and it'll hit a floor somewhere below. On the walls of the room, you'll find some pipes with valves on them, and you're able to interact with the valves, but currently, they appear to be stuck and only move very, very slightly. These are likely objects that we're going to need to use to unlock the next stage of the easter egg. There's a mysterious picture of a white horse inside the actual cell section of the room. No one again is really sure what this is supposed to represent at the moment. And considering it's in the cell, this is probably a painting that the cell's occupant was working on before they managed to escape. And finally, there's some scribbles on the wall behind the pipes that I mentioned earlier. These appear to be arrows pointing in different directions, and you can find some more of these scribbles at the shower block near the D flag. Now, all of these scribbles are different and can probably be translated into some sort of code, but again, that's still being worked on at the moment. This then does indeed appear to be just the first stage of whatever has been added to Fort DeVoe in Battlefield 1 with this latest update. As the search progresses and more information is discovered, I'll keep you guys updated and hopefully I can keep showcasing how to solve these easter eggs so you can do the same. It's not apparent at the moment if you have to complete each stage of the easter egg in order to move on to the next bit, so if you guys are interested in easter egg hunts, I'd get out there on an empty Fort DeVoe map later today, get this done so at least you've done the first stage and you're up to date with everybody else. So there you are, thanks very much for watching. Make sure you leave some comments if you have any theories about how we can advance this Easter egg from here. And make sure you go and join the Battlefield Easter egg Discord. That's linked in the description. Lots of helpful people over there. Go and share your ideas, read some other people's, and let's see if we can figure this Easter egg out. But until next time, my name is Westy, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.